This is Shenyang, the largest city in northeast China. In this region, animals are often subjected to the cruelest torture you can imagine, skinning alive. The fur farmers resort to this method because it's cheaper and easier, and the law doesn't care. As for the fur-wearing Chinese public, they have no clue. Graphic violence in awareness campaigns hasn't worked. It only makes viewers turn away quickly. We needed an approach that didn't depend on shock and awe, or blood and gore. A good horror story should let the audience's imagination connect the dots. We got 36 skilled sculptors to cover dozens of life-sized animal models, including minks, rabbits and foxes, in coats of pain. The shows travelled around Beijing and the chilly northeast provinces of China, where fur demand is ever-growing. Visitors went through different stages of emotion, from pleasure to surprise to horror, as they were first drawn to the animals, realised they were covered in needles, and eventually uncovered the story of their torture. The campaign, which extended to print and three-dimensional posters, was also spread by celebrities in the media. Over 80,000 have pledged to give up fur, and with each pledge, a needle online changes back into a strand of fur, and hope for China's fur animals increases. 550,386 pins. That's what it took to drive a single idea into people's minds. That fur is beautiful, but only until you look closer.